it brings the curtain down at what's been uh, an unbelievable week for both yourself and Henry and all connections as well. Go back to early on in the week, honeysuckle, what a result. It was just magic, wasn't it? Yeah, it really was. It's just a, it's a day I'll never forget. Um, like the, That feeling from the very top of the shoot, the whole way back in, the whole way up around into the winner's enclosure or into the parade ring like and the the, the the masses of crowd like it was just and they're all just looking at her like it was just it was incredible like uh yeah it was really it was an incredible incredible moment in my life anyway and yourself when you went by the line because you knew everybody was watching honeysuckle everybody wanted honeysuckle to win when you went by the line was it a, a feeling of relief that thank god we've done it yeah, definitely. Um, like there's, you know, every every letter I get in the post from from a kid, it mentions Honeysuckle, asks how she is, you know. So I, I know there's there's a lot of people tuning into her to see how she gets on, and uh, I was just delighted that we could we could deliver that day and uh, for for everyone. You know, she's been an incredible mayor, and she got she got to have that fairy tale ending, which you know. In this sport, it doesn't always happen. So uh, yeah, look, it was it was fantastic. And people tend to forget. I only said this to Paul earlier on as well. Willie alluded to in his interview yesterday at the Gallop in the Shop. The pressure you're all under. Were you feeling the pressure going down to the start and only circle, knowing that the whole world, anybody with any interest in racing, wanted this filly to win? Oh uh, yeah, I was definitely. I was feeling it on the build up. Like it was. Uh, Definitely feeling it on the build up, just to the whole week. Like it's Cheltenham, it's it's what our whole year revolves around. So, yeah, it'd be you'd be you'd be subhuman if you weren't feeling feeling it, I suppose. And but you know, it's it's a lovely position to be in. Um, well, I won't be in it in it again. On looking forward to her in Cheltenham, but you know, getting to getting to go to Cheltenham with with rides that you have to feel pressure for, like that's class position to be in. And fair play to Henry and all the team. They had her cherry ripe. I'd say you were confident all the way. You had a perfect passage throughout. Yeah, um, yeah, she was really on song now. Um, you know, there's been a massive team of people that have worked with her o over the years and yeah, it's it's a big thanks to them. Like Henry, obviously, uh, incredible to, to, to get trainer, to have her in the form he does every day she runs. But, you know, there's a lot of people down there that are putting in the graft as well to, to make sure that all the horses get to Cheltenham and get to the races in, in the manner they do. And of course a lot of people going there off the back of her run, the Irish champion hurdle, said she's not the filly she was, this is the strongest mare's hurdle has ever been run, which is true. And she showed that she was as good as ever the other afternoon. Yeah, she was incredible. Envy Allen, brilliant training performance as well. Yeah, fantastic. Um, yeah, he was he was electric. Uh, one one or two little errors, uh, but other than that, like he jumped superb and he travelled. You know, he was even travelling a bit too well early on. I was worried that he wouldn't switch off, but then he just does, and and he he, he was fantastic. And uh, yeah, he was he was incredible. How confident were you going to the Ryanair? Were you quietly confident yourself? You thought, hi, I riding him at home now. This horse is is back. He's giving me a good feel again. Yeah, you'd have to be like he's he's just a, you know, everyone knows the engine that that horse has, and you know, he's been in really good form all year. The last day in Kempton was just a flop, but. He, he was in brilliant form up to that and uh, you know we know what that horse can do and yeah I don't think it was a surprise to anyone that he put in that performance. And a Plute had a quick word on him finally as well. I thought you were, I, you looked very happy where you were until you were virtually wiped out of the race. You were very lucky to stand up. Yeah I, I, I was very happy, yeah I was very happy and it's just uh, unfortunate you know sometimes the the luck is not in your favour, and uh, but look, we were lucky. He was lucky not to come down himself. Um, so yeah, he's okay, and we 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 uh, we look to the next day. Great stuff, well, Rachel. Well done today, and well done during the week. It's been a fantastic week. Thanks, Kev. What a way for Honeysuckle to uh, end her career, and I don't think I've seen too many uh, horses get a reception yeah. like she's got that she got in the uh, Cheltenham Winners Enclosure today. Well done. Thanks, Kev.